Hello everybody. So today I will talk about physics. The topic today is about tensions. So now I will show you how to answer. So we have the figure number one. So I will show you how to find T1, T2 and T number three. So I will choose about G equals to 9.8. Meters per square second. So about T number three, that is so simple. We just put about T number three equal to M multiplied by three. And we have five kilograms multiplied by 9.8. And we have 49 newtons. Now I will go to T number one and T number two. So we have the black dog in here. So I will put black dog in here. And we know that T number three, they go in here because we have the bones. So they go down. So if we want to keep this one balanced, so they should have another vector go up. And now I will put about O, S, Y. That's about this one in here. So about T number one, they go this way. T number two, they go this way. So this is about vector T number one, vector T number two. So if we put the line in here, we have two parallel lines. So this is about 40 degrees. So the angle it in here should be about 40 degrees similar for 50 degrees should be in here now we can put the angle in here next we need to find the sum of the fourth on S and the sum of the force on y. We have s in here. So we have t number 2, but we want to find the vector on s. We know that this is about the triangle. So we, if we want to find this one, we use about cosine. We know that cosine equals to abjections. Over high hypotenuse. So hypotenuse is about T number two. And we know that cosine, we have 50 degrees. We want to find abjection. Abjection, that's it on S. So that should be about T number two multiplied by cosine 50 degrees. Similar for T number one. We see that this vector T number 2 cosine 50 degrees is opposite about T number 1 cosine 40 degrees. Because they are opposite, that means they need to minus each other.
because we know that this is about balance. Balance, that means everything false in here should be equal to number zero. Now, let's go to FY. FY, that's about this one. So, if we want to find about FY in here, we need to know that we have another vector from here. Similar for T number 2. To find this vector in here, we need to use about psi equals to opposites. over hypotenuse so for example this one is about hypotenuse we want to find the opposites in here so we have t number 2 in here to find about opposites t number 2 multiplied by psi so this one is about t2 psi 50 degrees Similar for this one. And we know that two force in here, they go up at the same time. So that means T1 side 40 plus T number 2 side 50 we know that t number 3 is opposite this vector in here so that means we need to minus t number 3 and because this is about balance so this one equal to number 0 so we put in the calculator, we find about T number 1, that's about 31.497 Newtons, T number 2, that's about 37.53 Newton and this is the technique how to find t number one and t number two now let's go to the next one in this one I will choose about three equals to nine point eight t number three is so simple just put about m multiplied by 3 now i will go to t number one and t number two so i will put the black dot in here t number three they go down T number 2, they go in here. And T number 1, they go in here. So, I will put about S and Y in here. Now I will need to find the sum of the force of Fy and the force of Fs. So we have 60 degrees. So the angle in here similar on the first one we just do. We put about 60 degrees. About Fy, Fy, oh sorry. This one is about Y, not S. About Fy, we know that 
That's it about this one. So we have 60 degrees and we have T number 1. So we use about T1 multiplied by size 60 degrees. So we know that this is about T number 3. T number 3 on Y. And this is opposite this vector in here of T1 size 60 degrees. So we need to minus. Because this one is balanced. So it should be equal to number 0. About S. We have this one. And we have another S in here. So we need to use about T number 1. Cosine 60 degrees. We know that this vector is opposite the vector T number 1. So we need to minus. Oh, sorry, this is T number 2, not T number 1. So that's the correct right now. So, so we have T number 3. We can find about T number 1 in here. So we put T number 3 go to the right. So we have T number 3 divide to size 60 degrees. T number 3 we have 98. We have size 60 degrees. So we have 113 boy 16 newtons. So after we have T number 1, we can find T number 2. This is the end. Thank you for watching.